Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Octopath Traveler, where we are going into Cobblestone. Where I believe we're going to meet Ulbrich. First, Curious Bloom. Component bearing unknown effects and an iron vest. Things are quite expensive here. Uh, that's the main quest. That's an inn. Uh, if you saw the previous video, which was only a short one, uh, you'll, you'll know that I've turned the, the depth of field off. Those mountains in the background, on the other hand, a little bit blurry. If I still got... Yeah, I've still got the ability to, to toggle kind of the inventory depth of field on and off, but it does this to it. <laughs> My job was to stay and protect the villagers. What you got to sell? Healing grapes? Well, it's interesting that the, the prices of things are generally all over the place. Village headman. Great. Oh, healing grape M. Silver clock, not for sale. So are those things that can be stolen with the thief? I feel like that's how that probably works. I'll have that. Always looking for a bargain. I certainly am. Uh, so we can... Remember that I need to click on the the people first. So we've got accuracy plus ten. That'll serve us well. Um. Oh, we can't buy anything from him. Yeah. See, see how subtle the depth of field effect is with this in comparison to the. You know, it's it's just just enough to give a little bit, but it screws up the menu. Um. They say there's a cave deep in these hills. Purifying dust. Potent medicinal component of large volume. Olive bloom. Curious bloom. I don't think this is where I should be going at the moment. <gasps> I am on rails. Go on then, let's talk to you. Those brick... Oh, that's old brick. Those brigands... What villains would take a defenceless child as a hostage? Hold fast, Philip. I'm coming for you. His name is Aldrich, and he is a warrior. Here in Cobbleston, a remote village in the Highlands, he hires out his sword under the assumed name of Berg. Once a great knight, he lost. He lost. He lost. Both Lund and Liege. As well as his reason for wielding a sword. Yet one fateful day, bandits raid the village he now calls home, stealing off with his protégé, the young Philip. Ulbrich takes sword in hand and sets off after the brigands. He will need worthy allies on the path. An octopus path. No, he has chosen. Party members, find comrades and add them to your party. Complete chapter one of their story and they will join you on your journey. After chapter one, you can change your party members at the tavern. I'm pressing the wrong button. Take Ulbrich along. Yes. Hear the beginning of the tale. Yes. Because I think I get to players. Yes. Him. Eight years ago. Help! Uh. Is he man or beast? There is voice acting. Slice! He's but one, yet fights like a score! Gods have mercy. That's the unbending blade of Hornberg! Ulberic Eisenberg! Ulberic Eisenberg! You know my name. You know my name. So to business. Who will be the next to die? <laughs> it's you who be dying. Look about you. We have the numbers. 
Enemy reinforcements on the left flank. To Sir Ulbricht's side, men. The blackguards have had their way for long enough. Charge! Ah, it matters not. We're done here. Sound the retreat. Withdraw to the rallying point. We win. Sir Ulbrich. Sir Ulbrich. Oh. I feared we would be too late. Nothing I couldn't handle. Can you hold this position? You make for His Majesty's camp, sir? Just so. Our foe attacked from both flanks. But we have no orders from the Crown. This concerns me. Oh? His Majesty is well guarded, sir. Sir Earhart is with him. I know this. Sir Earhart is a traitor. There is no stronger knight in the realm, other than yourself, of course, my lord. With Sir Earhart at his side, surely his majesty is in no danger. Unless he's a traitor. Perhaps not, but we must be certain. I would know how the battle unfolds. Besides, word from the king always lifts the men's spirit. As you wish, sir. We will hold this ground. So this is very dramatic. Be safe, and may the gods guide your blade. Thank you, Sir Ulbrich. And yours, Sir Ulbrich. But wait. Heavens have mercy. His Majesty's own guard, slain to the last man. Who could have done such a thing? I wonder. Earhart. Where is Earhart? So, it was you. I am shocked. My leash. Earhart, what is the meaning of this? Squish! Uh. What, what is with the incredibly low resolution mountains in the background? Are they supposed to be hidden by the depth of field normally? Mm. What? What have you done? Clank! Ah. Have you not eyes? The king is dead by my hand. Y yes What madness What treachery is this What treachery is this No madness here We call it treachery if you will mm, We did I got very nice hair A brother Bang ah! <gasps> Brothers, indeed. How many times did we cross swords like this in the practice yards? Is it is it, it sounds very Sean Bean-esque, doesn't he? And how many times have I told you? I see your every move, your every strike before it falls. And yet I can't keep myself alive in any film. As I see yours. Ah, but you've not seen everything. I saved one trick for the day I knew would come. Gasp! Fine. Always the same dream. Is that a circlet that he's got on his head? Was he got streaks uh, of grey in his hair? What is it? Crivens! How did you know it was me, sir? Crivens? One must always be on his guard, even when he rests. Yes, a knight... Hmm. No, I am no knight. 
Just a man with a sword, and nothing more. Quoth the raven, nothing more. No. If you say so, sir. But there's lots if of men who so. carry swords that can't do half of what you do. Oh, I almost forgot, sir. The headman's looking for you. That sounds a lot like a female voice actor. So he wants a word. He didn't say about what. No, that is often the case, I believe. They get female voice actors to do the, the, the role of young men. Tell him I'm on my way. I don't know why. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll go on ahead and let him know, sir. He'll be in the square. You know the one. I don't, but we'll find out. How many out. years has it been since Hornberg fell? My liege lost. My land in ruin. My hand a bit heavy in the writing. After a time, I came to this village. Here, I earn my keep as a hired sword. Why is he hiding behind taking this opportunity to soliloquy? Defending the villagers from bandit raids, teaching young men how to handle a blade. Not a glamorous life, but it puts food on my Little plate. bit exposition heavy, this. A man like me knows only the battlefield. Worth only as much as the blade at my side and the arm that swings it. When that blade fails to save my sworn liege, what does that make me? An exposition engine. For years, I've asked myself that question. No answer still. At least, not one I like. One thing I do know is that I owe this village a debt. A debt I intend to repay. But that's enough brooding for one morning. The headman's waiting. Of, of course, a lot of... The, the, fa the fact that it's pixel art means that a lot of action can't really be represented. Uh, Berg, sir. Yo. How there? Go on patrol, sir. Nothing to report. I see. Good to hear it. Hmm? Two of you today. Usually only one man does the rounds. Yes. Aye, sir. Headman thought it best. There's brigands in the hills of late. <clears throat> Poor merchant gutted for his coin purse just yesterday. It was a grisly sight, sir. Indeed. These are dangerous times. One can never be too careful. I hear the headman is looking for me. Just so. Ah, he mentioned that, sir. He should still be over in the square. Now, if you'll excuse us, sir. Morning patrol, resume rounds. So he has organised the town. They put me in charge of our local militia. We got brigands from the hills about, causing no end of trouble. If we knew where they were hiding, I reckon we could go flush them out. But we don't. That's the rub. Headman! Oh, ho! Ah, oh, Berg. There you are. <laughs> Good morning to you, sir. I see. Morning to you both. Philip said you wanted to speak to me. Ah, yes, yes. I'll get straight to the point. We've had reports of bandits in the hills. I see. I see. <laughs> You've doubled patrols. Oh, I yes, I was also hoping to ask for your aid. With bandits lurking, the villagers daren't venture into the hills. We cannot check the traps nor collect firewood. It's quite the predicament, to say the least. Mm. Leave it to me. Where can I find these thieves? I As for the precise location of their den, I fear I cannot say. I sent some of the men out searching, but... Berg, sir. In the meantime, could you put the militia through their drills? Our men are keen, but they don't know a pommel from a pike, if you get my meaning. 
As you wish. Consider it done. Beg pardon? Uh, sir, it would not be a burden my, my Philip joining the training. If it would not be a burden my, my Philip joining the training. <laughs> if he is willing, so am I. <laughs> oh, he's more than willing, sir. I assure you. Been pestering me for weeks to ask you. <laughs> oh, that's a brave lad. The boy has pluck and ambition. And he could find a worse man to look up to than Berg here. Aww. Ever since my husband died in the war, you know. Hmm. It's just the boy's getting to that age when he needs a father. No thanks. Oh. Oh, uh, I, I didn't mean to say. Mahaha. <laughs> Your boy is already a credit to the village. It would be my honour to train him. How can I ever repay you? You are too kind, sir. <laughs> it's settled then. Train the lad well and see that he does his mother proud. Not I see. I will. Utilize each character's unique action to overcome any obstacle. Ulbert can challenge townspeople to a duel. Challenge! Strength one. A battle, fair and square. To arms. It's always an honor to train with a warrior of your skill, sir. Let us fight with honor. Achievement a lot. A new challenger. Victory shall be mine. And pow! The battle is truly joy. Now then, warrior skills. Level slash. I didn't seem to do a whole lot more than. I should probably um my blade is unbending out of my way I disintegrated him with my blade the thrill of the fight do 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 items obtained now oh I've killed him <laughs> that's no good sir we're no match for the likes of you you are too hesitant. It is important to protect yourself, this is true. But you will never win a fight if you lack the courage to strike. If you say so, sir. Pretty birds. I can challenge him no longer. Uh, lady. Why, hi. I cannot challenge the lady to a duel. Philip. I'll challenge him either. You there! Watchman! A battle, fair and square. To arms! Always ready to spar, sir. Let us fight with honor. Let us fight. Victory shall be mine. With honor. Clang! Have at you. I will cut you down! Whoa! The thrill of the fight. Untouched. Broken. Soothing seed. Mm. Yeah, got me again. <laughs> you attack with boldness, but you leave yourself open. And so a simple counter blow quickly strikes you down. You must remember balance in all things. I see. Balance, right. I'll try to remember that, sir. That said, if you fought side by side, you might complement each other well. Indeed. I was just thinking that myself, sir. Just so. Better than the sum of our parts, eh, sir? <laughs> what do you say, friend? A side by side? <laughs> Two heads are better than one, eh? What's this? Something the matter, sir. What? No, sorry, it's a fine idea. Train together, and you will be capable soldiers one day. Yes. Sir. 
I thank you. The two of us will go on patrol then, by your leave. I see. Yes, good, if you would. <laughs> Sir, me next, please. Yes, let's beat this small child into a pulp. No. You are not ready yet. You need to work on your form. Hey, come on! Oh. Mm. Do the drills as I showed you, and you'll be sparring soon enough. You have talent, lad. I do? I see. Not many boys your age take to the sword so quickly, and I've trained my share. <laughs> Quivens! Well, thank you, sir. Quivens? Quivens? Um, my father. Uh... He's, you know, gone, sir. Died in the war. So I've heard. Mother's looked after me ever since. All on her own, sir. But soon, soon, I'll be a man grown. It'll be my turn to take, take care of her. <laughs> she is a lucky woman to have a son so brave. Hey, thanks. So you see why I've got to get stronger, sir. I have to protect Mother and everyone in the village. After all she's done for me, I owe her that much. Ellipsis. I too once had someone to protect. Ellipsis. Mm. Sir? It's nothing, lad. Just old memories. Keep at your training and you'll be a strong man before long. You got it. You got it. I will, sir. And you need to grow an entire third of a sprite. Mayhap I shall make a round of the village. I cannot do... Oh. Who are? Brigands! We're under attack! <laughs> but Berg, sir! Brigands from the hills! Dramatic music to ha 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 hearts. Find the brigands attacking the village. I think they might be there. <laughs> just a just a thought. Save successful. Uh, right, shall I buy a sword? I think I shall. Equip the iron sword immediately. Yes. And... Uh, ooh, you don't have a whole lot of money, do you? But if we get weapons sorted. Ah. Ah. These dirty peasants don't know their place. <laughs> we outnumber them. Surround them. <laughs> Take a blade in the back before the boss finds out swine had slowed us down. That's it. Do your worst, your boots. That's right. You're not going to pass us. Damn it all! These swanners know how to fight. Look, sir. I swear on. Good work, man. You did well to hold them off. But I'll take over from here. Arts cuts. And who in the hells are you supposed to be? <laughs> He's a bleeding fool if he thinks he can take us all. Hmm. Mm. Oh. So he's got a fancy blade, eh? I know you're so edge knight. Could damn a share of your betters. Don't think so. The hell? I'm telling you, this one's trouble. Indeed. You both have the right of it. I'm but a common hedge knight with no name to speak of. Have at you. But if you come looking for trouble, you've found it. <laughs> Stay it! I'll cut out your tongue. I. Enough, pal. Let's skewer him. I will not fail. Okay. Have at you. Have at you. Three versus one. Uh, so, we can increase our attack. Okay. So, I have a plan. The plan involves doing this. Ah! 
Have at you. It involves doing that. I will cut you down. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba. Now then. Uh, ooh, no. It involves this. I will cut you down. Tactics. With each battle, I grow stronger. With each battle, my voice gets deeper. Items obtained. Now, I kind of wish that didn't show up. You. You can handle a blade, aye? But this ain't the end of it. That's right. When the boss hears about this, you're a dead man, you hear? We'll see about that, won't we? Help! My mother! Uh, no. <laughs> That's not what that says. Oh, you can't even see what that says. Help! A boy! Hey, come on! Let me go, you ugly dog! Huh? Damn it. Something has happened elsewhere. Oh, Berg, sir. They, they took him from me. My poor Philip. He was trying to protect me, but the, those animals. Damn it all. <sighs> Forgive me, sir. There were so many of them, and... <sighs> it doesn't matter now. We have to save the lad. Let me see. We know where they are now. Hold up in the cave deep in the mountains. Indeed. Let's go. I don't know what they'll do to him. Wait. What? But sir, we have to do something. They might kill the boy. No. If you leave now, who will protect the village when the thieves return? No, you will be playing right into their hands. Uh oh. God's a mercy. Is there nothing we can do, sir? I see. I'll go after the boy. <laughs> uh, alone? But sir, even you. Hmm. And you stay and guard the village. At least until you're sure they're not coming back. Ah. Oh. Chief? I wonder. Ellipsis? Forgive me. And you are the boys. Our only hope. Can you do this, Berg? As you wish. Consider it done. Oh, Please, heavens. sir, bring him back safe. I swear on my blade. You have my word. And so I must go and save the boy from those ruffians. What's that you say? You wish to lend me your aid? Hmm. You seem like you could hold your own on the battlefield. It would be my honour to call you a comrade. Philip has been taken to the brigand's den north of the village. We must make haste. Ulrich joined the party. So... Ah, we now have proper monies. And we have things what we can buy. Do, 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 do. Silver vest. Uh, those are rather expensive. Uh, that's really expensive as well. Hmm. Hmm. But that's a lot of extra damage. Ah, what the hell? What could go wrong? I guess we'll find out. Uh, Berg, sir. Begin to hold up in yonder cave. It's surely most dangerous, sir. Let's prepare well before setting out. As I was saying, uh, we'll find out what happens in the cave next time. That's the first part of chapter... I assume this counts as chapter one of Ulrich's story. Yes. 
Yes, it does. So we'll find out what happens next. Next time. Obviously, because that's how time works. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you're enjoying my terrible voice acting. It's always a pleasure. Always a pleasure. Until then. Cheerio. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, why not click the like button and consider subscribing. Remember, you can ring the bell notification icon to get notified when new videos go live. And until next time, cheerio.